Despite our sometimes rocky relationship, Mike claimed we spent, at one point, we spent an entire year not talking to each other. We did, from time to time, conspire to liven things up on the ninth floor. We once, with the connivance of some Wall Street insiders, spread a rumor that we were buying 60 Minutes to take it intact into syndication. But the deal was contingent on excluding Don Hewitt. <laughs> Watching Don's reaction when the rumor reached him was what like witnessing liftoff of an Atlas rocket. <laughs> and we would regularly try sandbagging each other. I was part of a cabal that sent a spurious letter ostensibly from the so-called genius sperm bank, inviting Mike to join various Nobel Prize winners <laughs> in making a deposit or donation or whatever it's called. <laughs> he roamed the hall brandishing that letter, <laughs> proudly reading it to anyone who would listen. It took an hour to convince him he had been had.